Okay, I have my tissues ready and I'm going to try my best to stay composed through this final read here on the KSBY Anchor Desk. Six years ago, KSBY took a chance on an eager Cal Poly journalism student. I lived, breathed, and loved this job. Every experience, interview, and story has been a privilege. I've been surrounded by outstanding colleagues who helped me grow from rookie reporter to trusted journalist. Some of the most significant stories during my career here include the 2018 Thomas Fire and subsequent mudslides in Montecito. As a Santa Barbara native, reporting on those disasters affected me deeply, and I felt honored to have the responsibility to communicate vital information to our community. Now I will be taking my skills as a journalist and passion for public service to the Montecito Fire Department while well, I will serve as public information officer. It's a career I could have never anticipated career move, but I feel has been put before me at just the right time in my life. Still, it doesn't make leaving my family at KSBY and all our amazing viewers any easier. Neil, we haven't been co-anchors for very long and I wish we had been able to actually sit at the same desk together, but I'm so happy and thankful that you are at the helm of this show now. Along with Brooke, my new sister, you have been my rock, my confidant, and my best friend through all the ups and downs in this crazy business. Our awesome producer Daniel and directors Frankie and Josh, thank you for making me look good each morning and being such a fantastic team. Daybreak literally would not be possible without you. <laughs> I want to thank KSBY management for believing in me all these years and supporting me in my next professional endeavor. My husband, my parents, my Aunt Susie in Wisconsin who live streams every single morning. Thank you for always cheering me on. And to our viewers, I am humbled each morning to realize that thousands of you make a choice to start your day with me. It has been the honor of my life. Thank you for showing me grace through my stumbles right now. <laughs> Laughing along with us and making daybreak a part of your daily routine, I will always treasure this rewarding chapter of my life. <laughs> okay, all right, well, Christina. Whew, I did it. Holy cow. Somehow. You're amazing. Oh my goodness. One tissue. I don't know if I One, did it. <laughs> two, blot, blot. We did it. Oh my goodness. Christina, it's your final morning here uh, on Daybreak, of course, and we are wishing you well on your next chapter. But before we do, here's a look back at just parts of Christina's nearly six year stretch here at KSBY News. Since April 2015, and the air traffic control tower was struck by lightning today. Christina Favuzzi has served the Central Coast community. Reporting in the studio, Christina from the anchor desk, joining us for the news at 10. I'm Christina Favuzzi. To breaking news in the field, we have sunlight up now, Brooke, and that is taking us straight to the front lines to keep us informed. Embracing the community, part of this remembrance ceremony, you can see the procession happening around and lifting our spirits when we needed it most. It's really funny, don't you? <laughs> there are about two miles of track on this property in a backyard and we're running. Taking we're us to, to dozens of attractions oh, through Central Coast oh, Living. But hold on tight. <laughs> Some of them hidden gems in our own backyard. Trying to capture the beauty of these flowers. To Hundreds of stories told. Turns of Wallace Creek show. Unique Central in their own way. To the International Space Station. Brings us up to a check of the weather on this Thursday morning, Friday, junior. And teaching us so much along the way. Rung more true than it does tonight. Karina and Richard, back to you. We're live and local at the Whittier Fire in San Ynez. That'll do it for our news here at 10. We hope to see you again at 11 on KSBY. Thanks for watching. Good night. So many good memories there, Christina. And if you've followed Christina through her time here at KSBY, you know that was just a snippet of the incredible work she's done here. And we're so happy for her and what's to come, but we will certainly miss her on daybreak. I know I will. Oh, thank you guys so much. Uh, it means the world to me. And no, Neil, I know you're gonna do an amazing job. The last look at Skycam 6, have a beautiful weekend. Thank you all.